I just drove that little tractor out of the ditch and uh, we're gonna pull the trailer out. The rental rig, we don't know. Lost it. They lost it. Tore the ditch up. Tore up a hydrant. Then took off. The uh, skid steer and landed on its feet. I fired it up. And drove it out of the ditch. We're gonna throw a chain on it now and just pull the trailer out with the skid steer and load it up. <laughs> he taking all my gravy work. The bastard. Turn it around. We'll use the bucket. Ty, turn it around. We'll use the bucket. It should pull it out. If it doesn't, we'll just bring your truck up here. Cute little guy, isn't it? Yeah. He's been kind of cool. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Try or easy. You're probably going to stay down low, maybe. I don't know. That trailer can't wait up. No. It's recovering its own trailer. You can see down the road where our flatbed is. That's where he, uh, that's where he walks, went off the road and took out a concrete thing. Swing around that way. Okay, Ty, go grab the flatbed, turn it around, we'll get it on this thing. We'll, we'll, huh? Okay, we'll put the tongue underneath this, raise it up, I'll drive it up on there and load it and go. You can't beat having a rig recover itself. It don't get any easier than that. They could have just drug you out through the dirt like I, you were doing, and we would have that, thought it was normal. That's a two. Yeah, that's a 2012 machine. It's brand spanking new. I need one of these. You got one at your place now. Yeah, I need one of these. I have absolutely not a clue what I do with it, but, but you, you do something. I joined going to parade. <laughs> No, nope, no, nope, there won't be on these Oregon rigs. Oh, hey, got, hey, got stuff over here. Here you go. Hold it. Hold it, Ty. I won't knock you over. Not you, but like you. Hang on, grab your glove, Ty. Wipe this off for him. Hang on a minute, we'll wipe it off. That might be your tonnage anyway. Bin number? Sweet. Can't beat that.
that we need one of them. Yeah. Film still. So you guys are saying for the property owner that you put down Chinook Water District? Yeah. But we don't know the, the number of the hydrogen. And uh, right here, we got her. Guy? Right here? Got one more hook. Yeah, one more hook in the back, guys. We got a perfect hook right back here. Nothing to watch. Uh -uh. You just hope for the best. That's not a helmet. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hill, George Biggie. Truck they're towing it with. This is where that rig went off the road. They tore a speed limit sign clear out of the ground, wood to concrete. From here. See, it must have broke off. It almost, they didn't go through that ditch back there, did it? No. You can see where it came in. Right here. Right here. This is where they left the road with the first tire. Here. They took out this sign. Weird. Well, they traveled a long ways, about 175 feet, till they stopped. Almost 200, almost 200 feet, almost 200 feet. Weird. What the? Rental machine. They took out the 55 mile an hour speed limit sign, shared one safety chain off of it, or straightened it out. I don't see one single sign of a strap where that machine was strapped onto the trailer. There's no cargo straps, no chains, nothing. Which is pretty bizarre. You would think they would have had something on there. That's where the that's where they pulled the sign out of the ground. Only in Chinook there's beer cans everywhere down here. Beer bottles. <laughs> no, not one strap.